guys, it's Clearly and welcome back to my channel. Today I have a special video planned for you guys, but before we get on to the video, give it a big thumbs up and subscribe down below to join my clay base squad and make sure to turn on your notifications because I've got some super fun videos planned ahead. Now, on to the video. So you probably are wondering where I am. I am in my closet. So we recently moved into our house and you guys really loved me showing unpacking our house. So I decided to do a few more room videos because we haven't had a house in a while and you guys have been dying for this video. It's been a highly requested video. So to, let's just start off the closet. I'm gonna come out a little bit, out of the room. So when you first come in the, in the room, the house, you first see all of these this clothes. So here we have got dresses as well as sweaters, sweatshirts, and then Raquel's dresses and sweatshirts. Then coming up here, we have got this box, which is kind of just random stuff. Then over here, I've got a book thing. Then over here, we've got four different bins as well as some other bins. I'm not using those right now. Moving on to the top shelf, I've got a jewelry box with some stuff, some hats, and more hats. Okay, now onto this shelf. We, here we have got, this is like my area. So right here, we've got some candy. This is my candy drawer. This is my elect drawer, electronics bin. And then I've got bottles. If you did not know, I, really love bins and I love organization because of my OCD I tend to organize the crap out of everything so speaking of organization moving on to the next part of the shelf actually this isn't part of electro organization we've got Raquel's jewelry bin right here we've got another bin which has who knows what in it and another bin of who knows what this is just some of Raquel's stuff not sure what's in it so not gonna touch it but now, speaking of organization, I have got bins galore. So, we got these bins from Dollar Store. I know, kind of crappy, but I really don't care. It just holds my clothes, and it's easy, it's cheap, and they're all the same, and it's just wonderful. So, starting off, this first bin has got... As you can tell, I named mine. It says capris and skinny jeans. This one's got a lot of my ripped jeans, my mom jeans, my skinny jeans, as you can tell. This one actually is a lot of my ripped jeans. So we've got velvet jeans in this one, as well as ripped jeans and a shirt. Oh well. Then we've got some of Raquel's bins, which are stuff. We've got more stuff then moving on to another one of my bins i've got shorts i'm cleaning a lot of my shorts right now so that's kind of empty but then i've got pajamas pajamas and business clothes i'm not sure why i put all of that in the same box but oh well so here we have got shorts and um pants and then another one of raquel's drawers i keep calling them drawers they're not drawers what am i saying Moving on to the second shelf. We're already halfway done. I have got shoes galore, you guys. Like, look, boots, boots, heels. And a lot of this stuff is Raquel's as well. But there you've got it. Then we've got more bins. This one is underwear and swimsuits. So not so on the top shelf, it's more clothing like jeans. And it's all pants, and you'll find out why it's all just pants. Then we got swimsuits. Thank you to Rad Swim. I have a bin full of Rad Swim swimsuits. If you guys have never heard of Rad Swim, I'll link them down below. They are amazing. And this video is not sponsored by them, but they are amazing friends. Then here's Raquel's bin. Oh, it's already overflowing. Now, this is Raquel's underwear bin. Although I'm pretty sure it's all like just socks, so who knows. And my underwear bin. <gasps> and then we've got some pillows. I'm not sure what those are doing there, but pillows are always needed. Am I right? We're on the floor now. Very tired, but it's very comfortable. 
Um, we've got a hamper here. Here's my hamper. It's very nice and big, which is so needed. As of right now, it's not needed because we don't have a dryer. So that's really fun. But moving on to the bottom shelf, we've got way more bins. And these ones are all crates, pretty much. If you can tell, a lot of my bins are organized into specific things that they're used for. So this bin right here, we have got bags galore. If you guys are addicted to bags, why isn't this closed going in? It's kind of hard with uh, bins when <laughs> it's on the carpet. Then we've got pillows and blankets and another one of pillows and blankets, as well as my stitch. Comment down below what your favorite Disney character is. And that pretty much sums up this entire closet. Um, this one is one of my favorite closets because me and Raquel will tend to come and just sit on the ground sometimes and watch stuff if we wanna be alone. It's where we change, it's where we keep our secret stuff. And now onto our second closet. Yes, you guys, we have a second closet, I know. So when you come out of this first closet, this is where we just were. We move on to our next closet. I'm gonna close the door so you guys can't see it yet. So when we first open it, I have got shoes. Can you see all these shoes? Let's see how many pairs are Raquel's. Only one pair is Raquel. So I've got sandals and heels and I tend to, I like to put sandals with itself because I have so many pairs of shoes that I kind of need as much space as possible. So we kind of put those together and then tennis shoes I put in two different slots. Sometimes I'll squeeze them together but most of the time not really. And then when you first come in, we've got a top shelf and that's just got who knows what random stuff in it. And this is kind of the outside view of what it all looks like. This is what everything looks like. Can you guess which shelf is mine and which shelf is Raquel's? I think I just told you, but this is mine and comment down below what you can see is different about this. I'll give you five seconds. Yes, my clothes are color coordinated. I, if I didn't tell you 50 billion times in the other closet, I love organization. So I color coded it with reds, orange, yellows, greens, pinks, blues, purples, whites. And I have realized I have a good amount of whites, but I have a very, very great amount of pinks. Pink is my favorite color, same with my dad's, and it's just a wonderful color. And surprisingly, I found a lot of reds too. What I really love about color coordinating is I can find the right shirt that I want, and it's not all bunched up, and say I'm feeling red today, so I'll go look in the reds and then just find a really cute shirt. And it's just so much easier. Then we've got jackets. I don't have enough hangers right now, so I have to put those there. We've got some shirts. It's not as organized. Then we've got Raquel's clothes. I know, you guys. I can't even see Raquel's clothes. Like, like where is it? But that's Raquel's. She's got some stuff on the ground. And that sums up our closet tour. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope you guys liked it. Make sure to comment down below some other room videos you'd like to see. And I'm not sure if this video has come out yet, but we are doing a room tour on the Ohana Adventures, so I'll link their channel down below. Well, our channel, I guess, down below. We do lots of fun stuff, and if you'd like to see extra of me, go and check out our, our family's channel. And make sure to subscribe down below. Thank you guys so much for 100,000 subscribers. You guys are amazing. I love you all so much, and I could never not have asked for anything better. You guys are so amazing, and I'm just going to keep saying it, but thank you, thank you, thank you guys so much, and let's help me get to 200,000. Thank you guys so much for watching. Till next time, I love you all. Mwah.